Hi, I'm Randy Maxey with Infinity Cutting Tools. Today I want to talk to you about our dado measuring gauge. Let's take a closer look at some of its features and how it's used. Now the dado measuring gauge is designed to be used in conjunction with a, a stack dado set such as our 6 inch or 8 inch datonator. And what it's designed to do is to actually measure the thickness of the workpiece that might fit into a dado that you're cutting with a stack dado set. For example, you're cutting uh, dados in the sides of a cabinet to fit shelves in. This is where the dado measuring gauge comes in. You actually measure the workpiece like the shelf that's going to fit into that dado and that helps you set up your dado stack for the correct width. Now one of the first things you'll notice about our dado measuring gauge is the series of notches all the way around ranging in a quarter inch width all the way up to 29 30 seconds of an inch wide. And what you do with this is you actually take the dado measuring gauge over to your workpiece and you test the fit of the workpiece in each of those notches until you find one that just fits. Once you have that done, you can look on the dado measuring gauge at the markings and determine how to set up your dado stack. And let me show you exactly how that works. So I've measured the thickness of my workpiece and it turns out it's 25 30 seconds of an inch wide or thick. So I come over to the corresponding notch in my dado measuring gauge and you'll notice that each notch is labeled in inches and in millimeters. And then below that is a series of codes that you can use to set up your dado stack. Now each one of these codes is deciphered in this chart printed on every dado measuring gauge. For example, I know that for this particular dado I need both my outer blades, I need three eighth inch chippers, a three thirty seconds inch chipper, and one one sixteenth inch chipper to end up with a twenty five thirty seconds inch dado. So with the information I have now about which chippers and cutters I need, I'm going to go over to the table saw and install the blades and then make a test cut and then check the fit of my workpiece in that dado and see if I need to make any adjustments. For real fine adjustments, you may need to use a shim to adjust the width of the dado for a perfect fit. Another nice feature about the dado measuring gauge is that it not only works with the Infinity brand Datonator stack dado sets, but it'll work with any manufacturer's stack dado blade. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our blog where you can learn more about the tips, tools, and techniques we use here in the Infinity Tools shop. Finally, check out our Facebook page and give us a like so that you can stay up to date on the latest that's going on here at Infinity.